a lot of focus these days on foreign intervention in U.S. elections and even a renewal of the charges that uh, Vladimir Putin and Donald Trump worked together in 2020 or 2016. Today's lunch alert is sponsored by the Patriot Gold Group. Elon Musk warns that if Trump doesn't win, this may be the last election we'll ever have. But the interesting thing about that is that there is a long, long history of U.S. intervention in foreign elections. In the 1950s and 60s, for example, we regularly subsidized the anti-communist parties in Italy and France in particular and uh, made it possible to stop the communists from winning electoral power. In my own work in the Clinton administration, we intervened massively in the Russian elections to try to help Boris Yeltsin get reelected. The intervention took a unique form, which is that Clinton would get Gorbachev, would get Yeltsin on the phone on the red line and give him advice every week on his campaign. I know because I helped structure the advice based on the polling that Yeltsin was doing to which I had access. And then in the final act of major intervention in a foreign election, the United States intervened with Saudi Arabia to get them to forgive a $500, billion, $500 million debt repayment, a $500 million debt repayment that the Saudis owed, that Russia owed the Saudis in May of 1996, with the election scheduled for June. And that permitted Yeltsin to give back money and pay raises and make up for back pay for steel workers, coal miners, and all kinds of working class people, and was instrumental in flipping the vote away from the communists uh, to Yeltsin. Thanks very much for watching. Today's lunch alert is sponsored by the Patriot Gold Group. Elon Musk warns that if Trump doesn't win, this may be the last election we'll ever have. With 20 million illegal immigrants in the U.S., even if only 5% of them register to be lifelong Democrats, this is a one-party country and it's not Republican. With this uncertainty, Costco has seen double-digit growth in gold sales. Gold is hitting an all-time high, and Goldman Sachs' price target is now $2,900 an ounce by early next year. And silver has outperformed gold in 2024, up 32% and is at an 11-year high. With the election next month, you can't afford to wait. So call the Patriot Gold Group now. Thanks for watching. The Patriot Gold Group offers no fee for life IRAs to viewers of these videos. The IRA minimums are $25,000 and $100,000 for the No Fee for Life IRA. So call the Patriot Gold Group and ask for the No Fee for Life IRA.